And number two, I'll start by multiplying everything by two. Um, you might want you might start by multiplying everything by 10 in this problem, which would get rid of all the decimals, and then divide by five because you have a common factor of five. You can do both those steps in one by just multiplying by two. So we see that B is negative one and C is negative one. The average is negative B over two, so that's positive one half. And then we go back to our equation. B squared minus I'm sorry, average squared minus z squared equals c. Add z squared to both sides, add 1 to both sides. Turn 1 into fourths, so it becomes 4 fourths. Then you combine those fractions, take the square root of both sides. And we know the square root of 4 is 2. So we can simplify it a little bit. And then again, x is the average plus z. And another solution is x equals the average minus z.